Hey, and welcome to another 10-Minute Tipsy Thursday. This is your financial bestie, Treese, where I will attempt to provide you with financial strategies, solutions, and tips within 10 minutes or less that's going to help you protect and or grow your money. So in 2019, I wrote the book, Girl, What's in Your Purse? Women Inspire, Financially Prepare, because I wanted to make finances simplified and relatable to women. So what I do is I use items that are usually found in a woman's purse to explain financial literacy. So today we're going to talk about the items that you need inside of your makeup bag. You see, when we talk about a makeup bag, the makeup bag contains the essential things that we need to enhance our natural beauty. And as it pertains to finance, I believe that is your credit score. Your credit score is used to enhance your money. So let's take a look inside of all the items that you need inside of your makeup bag, aka that's going to make up your credit score. Number one, the first thing you're going to need is concealer. That is the starting point of putting on makeup, right? So the starting point of building your credit score is your payment history. You want to have a good payment history. 35% of your credit score is based on you paying your debt on time. Number two, the second thing that makes up your credit score is your debt utilization. So as it relates to your makeup bag, that's your foundation. Less is best. You want to have low debt utilization, which means the available credit that you have on your credit cards, you don't want to use all of it. Actually, you want to keep it under 30%. If you can keep it under 10%, that's even better. So the second thing you need inside of your credit um, report, AKA your makeup bag, is your debt utilization. You wanna keep that low, which is your foundation. Less is best. Number three, mascara. What does mascara do? It lengthens our eyelashes. So the longer, the better, which is your credit history. You wanna make sure that you have an extensive credit history. That lets potential lenders know how much experience you have in managing credit. Did you know 15% of your credit score is based on the length of credit that you have? So yes, number one, concealer. That is your payment history. Number two, is your foundation, that is your debt utilization. Number three is your mascara, that is the length of credit that you have. And now number four, that's gonna be your lipstick. Every woman needs a good mix of lipstick inside of their makeup bag. As it pertains to credit, you need a good credit mix. A good credit mix, there are three items that makes up credit, that is, a real estate, that's loans on top of, I don't say on top of, but that's a loan that you get on a mortgage. Number two, installment loans. That's like your car note, student loans, which is the devil, or like a boat loan, that's installment loan. Revolving debt, that is credit card. So there are three types of credit that you need to have inside of your credit profile. Mortgage, installment, and revolving. That represents 10% of your credit score. So you wanna think about that. So, and finally, last but not least, samples. So before making um, some makeup purchases, sometimes we wanna sample the merchandise, right? So that is consisted of hard credit in inquiries when we're talking about your credit report. This happens when potential lenders is reviewing your credit score because they want to see if they want to give you some money or not. So you don't want everybody pulling your credit report because literally 10% of your credit score is based off of how much you let people pull your credit score. So let's do a quick recap. What are the five essential things that we need inside of our makeup bag, AKA our credit report? Number one, concealer. That's your payment history. 
which represents 35% of your credit score. Number two, your foundation. Remember, less is best. That's your debt utilization rate. That represents 30% of your credit score. Number three, that's your mascara or your credit history. Remember, the longer, the better. Number four, that's gonna be your lipstick. You wanna make sure you have a good credit mix, which is made up of mortgage, installment loans, and revolving debt. And number five, samples, hard inquiries. 10% of your credit score, is based on you not allowing a lot of people to pull your credit score. So I hope you all find that um, very helpful and know what goes inside of your makeup bag, AKA your credit report. So for more details on how you can enhance your credit score on your own, make sure you grab the checklist um, below so that we can um, continue to help you protect and grow your money with good credit. Talk to you later.